Hello, hello guys. My name is Rajesh Rajesh Sharma. Today we learn how to move from one screen to another screen in iOS, iOS Swift 3. So just uh, go to the main dot store where this is our first screen and this is our second screen and this is the button that we need to click and we need to go to the second screen. So just go to the, our first screen view controller and this is the move action method that we need to use. So first of all, we need to create an instance of the second view controller that we want to go. So basically, to load a view controller from a storyboard, we need to use instance view controller with identifier this method. And this is our storyboard ID, and you can take this ID from here. Just here second storyboard ID second view controller ID and I use here this is view controller and this is the method that we use sad dot present and this is the instance of view controller and animated true you can set it false or true and completion nil I use nil and you can use closer or any method if you want to perform some action after the completion and this is the two two method navigation controller dot present and navigation controller dot push view controller i explain it later and this is our second view controller and this is the back button and this this yeah this is back button when i click this function will be called back action and when we use present so we need to use dismiss we need to use dismiss method So first we need to run it. The screen comes and this is the button go to second so just we need to click it go to second this is our second activity and here I explain you second view controller what we do on back action dismiss so when we just click on back it dismiss the second view controller and the first screen come on the screen and now we check the second method sav dot navigation dot controller dot present so let's see what happen when we use this method go to second it does not go because this is not working because the navigation con UI navigation controller is a subclass of UI view controller class and it maintain a stack for you so when we click on go to second it not go so we need to use this method self dot navigation controller dot push view controller and what this method do this method contain the activity in a stack so you just use this here navigation dot controller dot push view controller and when we click on go to second this is not working so basically it is not working because we need to use embed in navigation controller here i don't use any navigation controller so first we need to embed this activity in editor embed in navigation controller so here this is navigation controller now now it maintain a navigation stack for you and you are able to navigate through hierarchy content so first now see what happened when we open this 
equation for controller. it is run you can see there is a navigation bar here you can see here and when you go to second you can easily and you can see there there is a back button so when we use a navigation controller so I basically tell you before that the navigation controller is a subclass of a UI view controller class and basically it maintain a navigation stack for you so when you use a present there is a no stack maintained for you and and there is a no back button so this is the difference mainly present and push and one thing is that I want to tell you here I use dismiss Mm, but when you use navigation controller dot push view controller so you don't use dismiss because it mainly used with present view controller so when we click on this it is not working so we need to command it and use this method chat dot navigation control dot pop view controller so just run it and see the result this is working this is working and this is working so basically the main difference is that it contain a navigation stack for you and the present method does not contain to second and I want to tell you that here I use navigation controller dot present here you can see there is a no navigation bar on that so basically this is the difference between present and push between navigation controller and navigation controller dot push view controller you can see here is a no bar so basically I want to tell you that basically no navigation bar and back that is working because and here one more thing if you use navigation controller with a present so you need to use dismiss you can draw dismiss you do not need to use sad dot navigation what happen when we use this method using a present Here I use present. That this is not working. So basically, the conclusion is that if you use present present method, so basically you need to use dismiss method. And if you use push view controller, so you basically need to use pop view controller method. So this is the main difference thanks for watching this video if you think this is helpful for you so please comment it share it thanks